I'm Anthony Hudson. We're ready for Saturday afternoon football. And with me today is Gary Lyon. What a game we've got today, Hutto. There really has been a big build-up for this clash. Today's match between Essendon and Collingwood. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. It's a big day for the Collingwood defenders. If they can stop Essendon from being dominant inside 50, they've got a big chance to win this. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains prepare for the toss of the coin. Collingwood winning the toss. As the home and away season draws to a close, there's one final hurdle before the pointy end of the season. I can't wait for this, Hutto. On the doorstep of finals and everyone is building towards something, there's plenty to play for. Come into this game with really good form. By contrast, coming into this game with some poor form. Both sides look ready to get into the action just moments away now. And here we go. It's Essendon taking on Collingwood. Heffelk receives the ball. Side bottom just hunted him down. Heffelk attracted a crowd. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Uses it by foot. The ball mopped up. Gathers it now. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Uses it now. Cox flicks it over. Majacek couldn't dispose of it properly. Fails to fend off the tackler. Great tackle. Kick by Apple. A big contested grab. Gleason wants to keep it moving by hand. Brown kept coming and won the ball. Brown applying the pressure. Great tackling there, Hutto. Puts it into the 50. They chase after the loose ball. Ball gets cut off. Dugowie drives it at goal. Through slide to go through from behind. Collingwood go for Essendon, but one. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Hooker plays it to himself. Slams it on the boot. And the boundary line wins. Reed heads onto the ground. Ball tossed back in. Taps it down. He's got the footy in his hands. Thrashes it. It'll be a ball up right near the boundary line. Grundy won the duel. I'll have it. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. 
Punched away, decides to keep it alive. Unfortunately, not for long as the ball goes out. Grundy coming off for a spell. And the umpire will throw it in. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Umpire is going to ping him here, laying a strong tackle. Brilliant chase. Kicks the ball deep. Redmond marks in a bit of space. Clears the danger for now. Takes an uncontested mark. Gets a quick kick away. Over the top of the pack. Francis moves it now. Smith will be upset with that. Umpire penalises him. And it'll be a free kick. Dacos got him. Showing some really good pressure there. Maynard a long way out. Going for goal number one. To go did well to win that ball. 15 metres out. He gives it a ride. He sums up the situation and delivers. Yes, Hano. Gets his first. To go getting the crowd involved. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. We're back in motion. Majacek gets it down. Did well to get a hand in. Right, collects the loose ball. McGrath running off for a break. Now we've got a ball up. Thump clear. Scoops up the ball. Cutler has resources out wide. Snaffled up by Howe. Puts boot to ball. Found space for an easy mark. Brown plays on. Thomas marks uncontested. 35 metres out. He goes for broke. Never on time, never behind. Collingwood by eight points. Hook it laying up the options now. Ridley was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Ridley kicks hard along the boundary line. Gets into some space to mark this. Hurley looking to rebound with this kick. Hook it, clear and kick out of the defensive 50. McRae dug out the loose ball. Ridley gathers it now. Mops up the loose ball. Finding the loose ball was Zaharakis. Zaharakis going to be penalised here. Unable to create the space. Great tackling technique. Puts it on the boot. Meyer check marks. Sinks the slipper into it. The mark has been taken. Decides to go to the middle. Kelly takes a strong mark. It's a long kick. Brown collects it. Let him up, Robert. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. He's accepted. He has the ball. Brilliant tackle and wins it. Majacek sticks the tackle. Fantastic pressure there. He likes his chances from here. Into the post it goes. <laughs> Collingwood, but nine. Unsure of their next move, plays onto himself. Hook it with a low spearing kick. Marks in a bit of space. And the ball rolls over the boundary. Hooker heading to the bench. Ball back into play. Grundy won the hit out. Ridley onto the ball. Slick with the hands. Receives the handball and takes off. Well taken at ground level. 
The loose ball picked up. Dacos going for number one. Hits the post. Back to behind. The kicking seems to be contagious tonight. The margin is 10. The Magpies have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Does well to cut off the kick. 45 metres out. He decides to go for home. Like in the spot with that shot. Collingwood lead by 11. Unsure of their next move. McGrath gets in a good position. He can take off after that handball. It's a turnover. One down is in his possession. Gathered by Grundy. Can he put it through? Just sneaks it from behind. The Magpies lead by two goals. Collingwood are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Couldn't snaffle it. Umpire circling and pings him. Redmond wraps him up. Great tackle. The siren sounds, and that's the end of the opening term. The scores, Collingwood, 12 to Essendon, nothing. Collingwood started well. Now it's time for them to do it for four quarters. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Essendon can't have any trouble winning the ball. They just need to use it more. We're ready for second quarter action. The game is back underway. Thumped by Grundy. Didn't fumble. A clean pickup. The tackle deserves the free and gets it. Brown puts on the tackle. Coaches love to see that kind of tackle pressure. Got boot to ball. Marking in space for Redmond. Elects to kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. 50 metres out. Winds up and goes long. Takes that one strongly. 25 metres out. Right. Works one on the boot for goal. It's under two goals now. Moore ready to bring it back into play. Quainak leading the race to the loose ball. Thank you, the umpire calls for a stoppage. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. What a brilliant tackle. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Goes by foot. McDonald's tip and Woody marks it. With a driving kick. Goal! What a tackle! Didn't get away from the tackle. Constant pressure and rewarded. Good mark there. Dugovic sends one up towards the wing. Collingwood have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. They can create from this. Ball up in the centre square. Phillips thumped it clear. Opportunity for Majacek. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Collingwood are taking advantage of their Ruckman's ability. It gives them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend. Thumps it clear. He gains possession. Langford making his way onto the field. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Grundy thrashes it. Ridley collected the ball well. Ridley kicks it to the square. A chance to reload the attack now. Moves it by foot. A great mark taken there. 
Looks up with the kick. Side bottom. Looks to get onto the football. Moves the ball by foot. Cox marks in a bit of space. 35 metres out. He slams it towards goal. It's only in the high. Inaccuracy costing them again. Collingwood by two goals. Hooker to kick it in. Cox takes a strong mark. Big kick required from this distance. He goes it alone. Offline from behind. Collingwood, 14. Lead Bessenden, 1. Ready to bring it back into play. Hookack decides to go to himself. Looks to move it by foot. Gets into some space to mark this. Dacos has a great set of hands. Collingwood, they're allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Going for goal number one. Thomas couldn't quite nail the kick. Collingwood with the ascendancy over Essendon, leading 15 to 1. Hooker deciding where to go with the kick here. He drives it. Tries to release the pressure. Hands that ball to the opposition. And the umpire will ball it up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Adams slips high and gives away the free kick. Moves the ball by foot. Redmond with the mark. Elects to kick. Gleeson determined to reach the ball. McGrath was taken high in the tackle. Now with a low spearing kick. Phillips runs after this one. That's holding the ball. Dacos creates all sorts of problems for his opponents. Great tackling there, Hutto. Looks to move it by foot. Well picked up. Ball picked up. Gets it away under pressure. Moved on by Redmond. The ball finds Eason. Goes by foot. McRae looking to track down the footy. Dishes it off. Quick hands. And they could be away here. He drives it. Takes a strong mark. Sear drives the kick. Takes a simple grab. Moore bangs it on the boot now. Dacos takes the mark. Keeps the kick low. It's a foot race to get this one. Sinks the slipper into it. Intercepts the ball well. Chris with a drilling ball. He wins the ball in the air. Greenwood has resources out wide. Zaharakis couldn't hang on to the ball. Phillips channels a long kick. Steady hands there as he holds that one. The Magpies haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Picked up by Phillips. Thrashes it. Wins the race to the ball. Now we will get a ball up. Punched away. Gets the loose ball. He drives it towards goal. A drop punt through the goals. Zaharak is enjoying that goal. The Bombers reduce the margin. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Swats it. Finds the loose ball. Uses it now. McMahon gets in a good position. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. McMahon doesn't even come close. Half-time, and it's Collingwood. 15, 
to Essendon, seven. Collingwood have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. What stands out for you, Gaz? Collingwood are behind in the uncontested footy, but so far they've made sure it hasn't been too damaging for them. Thanks, Gary. It's half time, and we'll be back soon for the second. Second half action about to commence. Back in the middle now. Grundy thumps it clear. Holding the ball. Grundy cutted him down. Big tackle. Goes the long option. McGrath did well to win that ball. Puts it on the boot. Marked by Deason. Goes with the kick. Finds this and marks well. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Collingwood, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Collingwood are getting first use from their ruckman. Thank you, I'll have it. We'll get a stoppage. Grundy just swats it away. Dug it out. Fantastic chase and tackle. Merritt finds a way to hang on. Outstanding pressure. Uses it by foot. Takes the mark. Ridley has resources out wide. Ends up turning this ball over. An easy grab for Pendlebury. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Got boot to ball. The ball goes over the boundary in the pocket. The ball is coming back into play. Right, hurls it away. Dug out by Cox. Releases by hand. A chance for Daharakis. Welfie links up with a chance to run. And now we'll have a ball up. Punches are clear. Heffel has the ball. Cleanly picked up. Let him up. Go better. And we'll get a ball up. Right with the punch. Collects the loose ball. Picking it up was Langford. Finding the loose ball was Apple. Had plenty of the ball. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. Brown doesn't look likely to come back on. And the umpire will ball it up. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. Hammers it. Heffel now heading to the bench for a break. The umpire calls for the ball now. Clears the contest. McCray wins the foot race. The umpire calls for it. Thumps it clear. The ball spells the clear. Thank you, I'll have it. Hammers it. Adams picks up the loose ball. Side bottom, plays the tackle. Fantastic tackle. Elects to keep moving. Doesn't take the mark. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hunter. Huh? Fantastic chase and tackle. A great defensive effort. Chose to kick it. Does well to keep it in play. Goal! What a tackle. Harris hunting with authority. Great attack on the ball carrier. Parrish sends one up towards the wing and the ball bounces across the boundary line. We'll get a ball in. Toss back into play. Punches are clear. McRae with the ball. Majek kicks it. Kelly collects the loose ball. They can create from this. Hooker earns a free kick.
puts boot to ball. Takes a simple grab. Ridley works the ball up the ground. Dacos on top of the ranking points. He's on fire at the moment. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. It's a very tense at the moment. Umpire tosses it in. Grundy clears the contest. Dacos controls this one. Decides to kick. McMahon marks uncontested. He takes the shot. That is a stunning goal. He loved that one. Collingwood but 14. We're back in the middle now. Grundy with the hit. Giving it off was Hendlebury. Makes it somebody else's problem. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Clears the contest. Thank you, Ivan. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Big thump from Grundy. He wins possession. Majek runs onto the field. We'll get a stoppage. Phillips gets onto the ball. Might be a bit of an injury for Pendlebury. Gaz, what does it look like to you? Yeah, definitely something wrong here. He's trying to get off the ground as quick as he can. McCray was taken high in the tackle. Marks now and can send it back. Collingwood just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Use the hands and gives away the free. Couldn't keep the ball in play. Right, coming onto the ground. Umpire calls for a boundary throw. Thrown in now. Thrashes it. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Right, won himself a free. Punches the kick. A good job keeping it in play there. Eventually, the ball goes over the line. Howe coming on. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Great tackle! Stringer shuts him down. Great attack on the ball carrier. Slams it on the boot. Moore gets the loose ball. Moore throws the ball away. Perkins gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Might be too far out to score. He heads for home. Always the The scoreboard starting to worry Fessenden now. More to bring it in. Dugowie takes the mark. Dugowie kicks hard along the boundary line. And the ball trickles over the boundary. The ball is coming back into play. Punched away. Just got the hands in the back there. Langford goes for it now. And he's missed. Essendon won't be happy to see that score. Collingwood ahead going into the final term. They lead by 12. Collingwood walking to three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. A low-scoring third term will see both sides looking for alternate pass to goal in the last quarter.
Dacos on top of the ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Last quarter action, ready to go. Oh, they've got to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. Grundy with a big fist on it. What a brilliant tackle! Dragged down by Grundy. Brilliant chase. With a driving kick. Thomas failing to get near it, Gaz. That's right, Hutto. He just can't seem to get into the game. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Gets the loose ball. Thank you. Now we've got a ball up. Thump clear. Saharakis elects to kick. Bounces over the line. Ball tossed back in. Phillips with the punch. This is Francis. Clears the congestion. A chance to reload the attack now. Adams has resources out wide. Doing well to intercept that kick. Uses it across half back. Turned it over. Magic runs onto the field. Swats it. Let him up, Robert. And now we'll have a ball up. Grundy thrashes it. Now it's a ball up. Punches it clear. Grundy keeps coming. Francis making his way onto the field. Winning it was right. The loose ball scooped up. Gathers it now. Going for goal number one. Pendle can't afford to miss some chances like that. It goes through for yet another behind. Collingwood starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 22 to 9. Redmond used the body to take that mark. He spears the ball. Francis found some space and marked. Collingwood haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Heffel spears the ball. Redmond gets right in his face. Fantastic pressure there. Just roost the bomb. Magic gets on the end of this. Searches for a teammate downfield. McRae not getting much of it, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Heffel steers it towards goals. He's enjoying that goal. Essendon closed the gap to seven. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Collingwood are allowing the opposition uncontested marks, but they sit up behind the ball so well it forces the opposition to play that style. Centre bounce. Thrashes it. Collected by Guelphy. Tries to gain some territory. The umpire will ball it up. It's a big stage of this game. Grundy got a fist to it. Thank you. Thumps it clear. Collected the ball well. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. The tackle deserved a free and gets it. Fantastic tackle. Reed uses it by foot. Marks that ball uncontested. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Collingwood, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot.
couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. They're doing really well to chew some time off the clock here. Going for goal number one. Drop punt finds its way home from Nene. Look at them celebrate that effort. Collingwood lead by 13. Back with another set of bounce. Punched away. Cutler grabbed it clean. Ball up in the centre square. Clears the contest. Phillips coming off for a spell. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Right, thumps it clear. Francis made the tricky bounce look easy. That's holding the ball. Constricted by Guelphie. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Moves it by foot. Hurley with an easy mark. Looks up with the kick. It's marked by Cutler. Gets it away. Quickly onto the boot. Stringer gets in the way. Dacos wins it back. Right. Bobs the handball. What a brilliant tackle. Side bottom gets right in his face. Great tackling technique. A low stabbing kick. The contest, no match for him. That's true, Rado. Chris goes with the kick. Finds a target. Collingwood have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. It'll be a ball up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Right, just too high with the tackle, with a driving kick. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Spots it. Merritt now releases the handball. He's got the footy in his hands. Hits the target by hand. How? Bear to mop up. Keeps it moving. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Heffel gathers it now. Sweeping handball. Fantastic chase and tackle. The ball's knocked loose. Maynard goes for territory. The ball ends up with Greenwood. Sinks the slipper into it. Open opportunity for Degoe. Elects to kick. Right. Cuts it off. Ball up called. Right. Thumps it forward. I'll have it. And the umpire calls for a stoppage. Thump clear. Holding the ball! Heffel creates all sorts of problems for his opponent. A great defensive effort. Chose to kick it. Hurley hangs on to that one. Chips it towards half forward. Intercepted. Smith will be the recipient of the free. A chance here to convert Fessenden. 45 metres out. About to take the kick. Slide angle. Moving on. He takes aim. Kept his head and kicked the goal. No doubt about it. Smith celebrating hard. Just under two goals, the difference now. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Essendon have been poor going forward today. The opposition are taking plenty of intercept marks and it's hurting them on the scoreboard. Hammers it. Not a great performance. And in the end, it was a poor result for Essendon. What stood out for you today, Gaz? A big result for the Magpies. They'll be loving this result. Thanks for that. At the end of the game, the scores are the Magpies 28, Essendon 21.
Thanks for joining us, Gaz, but that's all we have time for. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match.